Do I really have to start like this? Hey everyone, this is Esplay Games, and welcome back to Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. In the last episode, we were in the sewer area, cleaning up all of the messes in the sewers, and right now we're fighting the Queen. Quite ironic, since we're trying to help out everyone, but whatever. So, the Queen has mainly a few pretty basic attacks. She likes to hit you, she likes to shoot shockwaves, and if you notice, you can hit Queen Bee or her arms. Her arms are going to be the more important things to do because, well, obviously, they're not guarded by the crown, and that will be acted as a spiky object. Since, unless you use your hammer, then you'll be able to attack her. And, oh, oh, oh. Oh, sweet, I actually reflected that. Oh, God, I'm low on health. I just noticed that. Actually, let me use a nut. I only got one, so might as well savor it. Okay, mostly healed up. Not bad. So let's use a bounce bro. Alright, and there, there, bam, 23. So, as you see, her hand gets really, oh my gosh. Anyways, her hands, like, lose all of her muscle and it becomes really scrawny, which is, from that, you'll be able to attack her, because I believe her crown will fall. Eight, uh, that's not, yeah, her crown falls. And then she just looks like an ugly housemaid, and she coughs up beans. Oops, did not mean to do that. So yeah, whenever she spits out the beans, you don't want to jump on them, or else it'll spawn minions, which is not good. So obviously you want to do the most damage you can do to Queen Bean as possible, so slam her in the head! Uh, okay, jump? Uh, okay, whatever. <laughs> it's alright. <laughs> like, this is the one time you actually want to dodge an attack, because usually, whenever you want to recoil it, it will hurt them back, but this time it actually spawns more enemies, so it's really annoying. And then our bulgy eyes, and we're pondering on something, and advance! <laughs> Italian gibberish. And I don't know what they're saying. So let's just do this once again. Flutter in the air, grab you in the air, and then kaplam! Alright. Eh, there we go. Uh, you're just gonna cough up more? I really- Oh my god, Mario! You are weak! You need to get back in shape! I mean, Koopa the Quick even warned you about this. <sighs> Jeez, Queen Bean must have had a bad diet with all them beans. But something I'd also like to talk about, it's finally good to play this game again because I was on vacation in Cabo and oh my god, it was so good. The actual traveling there was terrible since we had so many cancelled flights, it was... It was bad. Really bad. But oh! Yeah, okay, so her muscles are back, and her crown, so she's mainly able to be defensive and very offensive, so we gotta watch out. Um, I guess just Splash Bro again. Alright. And you spin me right round, baby, right round. Alright. I wish I was actually on the overworld, because there's way more things to talk about, and I'm not as focused. Because I'm just mainly to do whatever I want. Oh my gosh! Well, I mean, it's weaker, but I went faster, so... Jeez Louise. Alright. But like what I was saying before, I don't know, I have better commentary when I'm in the overworld, because I'm able to view more things, I'm able to lollygag, I mean, I'm still able... I still have to do the mission assigned to me, but... I'm able to do whatever I want, essentially, because it's an RPG. RPG is a role-playing game, you get to do whatever you want! And that was super easy! Alright, and... Oh, I thought I was about to die to a bean. That would've been hilarious. But we killed Queen Bee and we got a lot of items. And speaking of that, level up! Now, I actually really wanna ante up my health because it seemed like I was close to death a lot. So, no. Oh my god, can I get the four? No. Of course not. I always assume I'll get the best. That's actually something I do a lot. I o I actually presume that something terrible will happen, but then the good outcome will happen, and then I'm a lot more happier with what happens. Okay, too. That that's good. All right, pose and go back to the dialogue. Ew, no! Can't let our force queen be to eat a belly blitch worm. That's what turned her into this. <laughs> Fear Kingdom is doomed! Doomed! How will we ever return Queen Bean to normal? The plumbers know what to do. They know everything. Well, what's that you say? The Mario Bros. will do something about it? Of course! The Mario Brothers, they do everything. What can you possibly mean? You speak of the impossible! <laughs> <laughs> well, 
We had to touch toes with her. Why there's no why there's no known way to spit out an ingested be belly belch. Belch? Belch? What what is it? I don't know what it is. Well, except there is one way. A last resort. Sure's a pretty though. C section, I mean what? She may be able to spit it up if she drink the legendary Chuckle the Rivers from Chuckle Hawk Wards. Oh my gosh. Plot device! You go to Chuckle Hawk Wards? Of course! We love some adventure. Of course! What if you're going to make such a bold proclamations? I suppose I have no choice but to rely on you. <laughs> Look at Luigi, he's just like, I wish I had green skin. Oh, speaking of Luigi, with the year Luigi kind of just going on still, there hasn't been that many games. There's been about three games specifically made for him, or just had him as a bigger role. Like Mario's Dream Team, you travel in his dreams, which is a pretty cool gimmick, but I can imagine getting really weird later on. And then you also have Super Luigi, New Super Luigi U, which is mainly a, a remake of the game for the New Super Mario Bros. Wii U. But it looks cool. And oh, we are getting announced by the little bean boy. Lady Lemon has asked that you also tease us along with you. Alright, so we got a bean badge. And we are introduced to a new to new equipment, so. Different badges have different effects, so for now I'll, if you get a badge, make sure you equip it. Usually that's good. But yeah, mainly badges are just mainly little upgrades that you can wear, so. Select this icon. Alright. Here you can see the gear and the badge you'll equip here. Okay Mario, time to equip the badge I just gave you. Alright, whatever. Select this icon. And see, look, the anti-up bar power. It's really nice. Alright, press A and you'll equip the badge. But that's for Mario. So, eh. <laughs> Luigi! Stop it! <laughs> oh, uh, sorry Luigi, but if you want your own badge, you'll have to go buy one at the store. <laughs> Look at your crouch, Mario! <laughs> oh my god, we just just like, no fucks were given. Oh no, we're in a destroyed town. But anyways, we can actually go to the store and buy more stuff, which is really nice. So might as well. I believe she sells the badges. The only one who still worries about fashion despite the town's crisis are real celebrities. Let's see what we can get. Flashy badges! Alright, so that... A P badge? Wait, okay, so that lowers brother power, but raises power. I'll give it Luigi. Alright. Wait, actually, I'll, wait, wait, wait. Let, let's look at the overalls. Alright. This is defense in that. Alright. Those are. Okay. Um, I'll give him the Mario. I'll give him the Mario. And then for Luigi? Ooh, that would be really nice, but I don't have enough cash, so I'll just give him the bean trousers for now. So, alright. We will actually buy some more items, not clothing, because we're not fashionistas. We need to solely survive on what we have, so let's get some more be Oh, they don't have beans. Crap, okay. No more shopping. Please leave- Oh my gosh. That was just rapidly spinning around. So anyways, now we gotta go to, um, Chuckle Huck Wiz. And that is quite an adventure away, so... I believe if I actually bring up the menu and go to the map... Okay, good. The show fly that indicates where we gotta go. So we gotta go down. Oh, speaking of such, I believe it's this pathway. There's a warp pipe somewhere. I believe it's here. Where is it? No, wait, this is a school. That's spoilers. Okay. Yes, Mario and Luigi go back to high school. They weren't that smart. Oh, it's right here, right here. So look! Remember the warp pipe from Stardust Fields? Now it can travel back! So it's actually a very nice deal of transportation, but you have to actually unlock or find the warp pipe, which is... which can be kind of a challenge. So I've already skipped over two of them before, but I'll show them later. We're off to see the woods, the wonderful chuckle hook woods. We're on the bridge and there's enemies and they want to kill me. Um... Uh... Wait, can I... Oh god. Okay, that was very unexpected, but um... Do I actually have to spin all the way over there? I actually think I got a spin jump. 
I thought I was able to high jump for some reason, so that was um, a delay of sorts. Let's just have that prepared. Oh, what do you know? The game knows what to do! Alright, sweet! Oh my god, look at these butlers. They look so Russian. Travel here is permitted only. For select individuals in order to guard the chuckle huts with ecology. Da? Oh! Oh! The Bing Bing brooch. The mark of special gifts of Bing Bing Castle. Very well then, we shall permit you to enter these woods. Da! Oh my gosh! They just... <laughs> Those bars just plunge themselves into the ground. They want to be like moles. Okay, so let's go back to our regular Mar Mario and Luigi team. Because Luigi will not lead. Even though it's his year, he doesn't deserve it. He's a baby. Okay, we cannot... Actually, something I'd like to talk about. When we get a power-up, well, power-up slash item later on, we'll be able to dig up or uproot these little signs on the ground. I won't tell you what they are, but if you play this game before, you'll probably... <laughs> If you play this game before, you'll know what they are, but there's some people who haven't played this game. Just because they were kind of shocked how different it was. But let's save, and we are out of the sewers, and now we're in a factory. Chateau de Chuckle Huck. Hallway. Chateau. Oh, I remember. BAM! That was, that was late. But Chateau de Chuckle Huck. Isn't that, um. Ugh. I'll ask my. I'll ask a friend. But yeah, this is mainly where you're able to. Make all the fruit drinks and stuff. I always thought of this to be as like a beer factory as a child because I also live near, um, in the St. Louis area. There's like a Bud Budweiser factory and it's very cool. And look at all the, look at all these kegs. <laughs> Some people would just die of happiness. Now this, I, it, there's actually a way to notice which way you're going. If you notice between the barrels, okay, you see where, um, the red and green are? And how I'm able to go up here. The darker purples are places that are barriers. The light purple are areas I'm able to walk through. And obviously the barrels are there just to support the use of having um, a difficult time to drop through. So, um, I believe if I... It's actually not this hard, but I'm just not very focused at the moment. Oh, what? what? Okay, yeah, I got trapped. I have to trap. Uh, can I go this way? I can. I can go behind. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so this way should be good. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Who are you? D dude, get back here. You stole my brother. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Did you see that little man? Like, he was creepy. Alright, so let's just high jump onto here. Alright, that was pretty. Oh, don't you dare fall down there. That would have been embarrassing. Oh! Boo! Blast! Criminy! The famous shadow thief Popple has been caught in full sight! <laughs> I see you right now. Wah! Cripes! You think you're ready? Do ya? Well, nobody's more ready than me. See, I'll show you! Uh oh. Rookie! Rookie shake a leg! Yes, boss! What? Is that Bowser? Okay, Rookie, it's your turn. See, I want you to squash those red and green drips there. Yes, boss. <laughs> They're just... <laughs> Luigi's performing the dance. The ritual dance. <laughs> Red and green. I feel like I know these two from somewhere. Weird. Has he been, like, hypnotized or something? What? Rookie, are you saying you're acquainted with these two Apollo guys? Yeah, something about them seems real familiar. It makes me feel real mad. What you're babbling to? Oh my god. He's like grinding his teeth furiously. You two ugly muns came here for the same reason as us. You want the fabled chuckle or reverse? Boo! Boo, I say. You really think you can beat me to the punch? Well, open up those ears, Pong. I, Popple the Shadow Thief, filter of the world's riches that you, that I, <laughs> sorry for the pause, my brain just farted. Bet you that I get the chuckle or reverse first. Rookie, go to it! So, we have another boss fight. Well, boss fight? That's a thing. Crap, I don't know. Um, I'm just gonna take the safe way and just hammer him. Because I don't know if his horns actually are activated as- Oh my god, he's checking hammers. Oh. But, um, I don't know if Rookie's horns on the top of him actually would count as- How dare you guys try to mess with a great popple. 
All right, that was pretty simple to dodge. <laughs> He's just like, nye, nye, nye. Nye, 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 nye. <laughs> he reminds me of one of those like, like one of those very stereotypical. Wait, would this actually? Okay, good. It actually doesn't count as spikes because just the headpiece kind of worried me. But the reason why it reminds me of like someone from the UK actually stealing is just because I've been hearing a lot of crime, crime scenes from there. So, yeah. Oh, oh wow, that was embarrassing. All right, just go for rookie. Because obviously, if I try to attack Popple, even though he's much weaker, rookie will attack way more. He'll just, for some reason, fighting these guys makes my gut flare up for some fears. Oh God! Whoa, that was spicy. Great work, rookie. <laughs> Great work, rookie. You just keep at it. See? Okay. Fire! Yum! Not fireballs, but fire. Alright, just keep on trucking. Keep on trucking with them green eyes. Oh! 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 I got heartburn! And that is what you get. Ah, rookie! That'd be a terrible thing if you actually, um... That was the actual effect of having heartburn. I've had heartburn twice, and it wasn't pretty. Yeah! Hack. Rookie, you bloated idiot! How took you and when you were dazed and lost in the mountains? Me, you worthless vermin! I'm so ashamed. Meh, I don't care, see? We're fine as long as we give the chuckle a reverse. Let's not mess with these two knuckleheads. We'll scram and hurry on ahead. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Look how slow he runs. Um, what else are we doing here? I'm playing the wrong part of the song. Okay. Well, there's actually a save block, so I'm actually gonna call this an episode and hope you enjoyed. So, now we're in the Chateau of the Chocolate Solo, and I'll see you later. Boom!